because we're going to put a lot of coal miners and coal companies out of business. This person is running for president? She really went with the all put Americans out of work line. Tone deaf. I come from generations of coal miners, both sides of my family. Some were fresh off that boat. Coal jobs put food on the table and a roof over their heads. I find it weird considering Democrats pride themselves on being the party of the poor and middle class. Well. When you're white, you don't know what it's like to be living in a ghetto. You don't know what it's like to be poor. Ever been to once booming coal towns in Appalachia? Lots of white privilege there. I've seen that level of poverty. I remember as a kid, I was visiting and we went to this yard sale. There was this woman who was selling half used bottles of suave shampoo and toothpaste. That image still sticks in my mind because it was so shocking to me as a kid to see that level of desperation in America. Poverty isn't a race issue, it's a human issue. To see the government intentionally regulate away the coal industry and destroy jobs in those areas, that's twisted. Yes, Hillary says she's going to replace those jobs. This is the arrogance of government. They think they're all knowing and can regulate the economy into doing whatever they want. Except that's impossible because politicians have limited knowledge. The market is so complex. You can't centrally plan it. Let's regulate one industry out of existence and artificially prop up another. Down with coal, up with green energy. No, what are you doing? Now, some people might say, aren't coal mining jobs dangerous? Yes, there is definitely risk involved in coal mining, but a job is better than no job opportunities at all. Then they might ask, well, what about green energy jobs? Evergreen solar, beacon power, Nordic wind power, abund solar, razor technology, cilantro. These and dozen others are taxpayer funded green companies that have gone bankrupt. Are you against progress? It would be one thing if the market deemed green energy as profitable. There would be a gradual shift from coal jobs to green energy. These would be actual steady jobs. What's happening though is the government is taking away money from us and investing in green energy companies that will not be able to provide long-term employment. Which, by the way, is a form of corporate welfare and makes it difficult for non-politically connected green companies to compete in the market. This is the government. We're going to help you. First, we're going to destroy your job. Oh, but don't worry. We're also going to funnel some of your money into companies that will most likely fail. Thanks, government. 